Hi, in this video we're going to be comparing these two keyboards. The brand of both keyboards is actually Amazon Basics. This one is an Amazon Basics wired keyboard. I use this one all the time on a daily basis. This is my main keyboard. I personally prefer a keyboard to be wired. I like wired keyboards. It's just how I am. So this is my daily keyboard that I use all the time. And in a minute we're going to take a closer look and we're going to compare them side by side. So you can look at the button layout and we'll talk about how they feel. This one on the other hand is a wireless keyboard by Amazon Basics and it even comes with a wireless mouse which is pretty cool also by Amazon Basics. So you get the wireless keyboard and the wireless mouse and it's a combo. So really awesome if you are looking for a wireless keyboard. It's great brand, Amazon Basics makes great products. I've used this one a little bit but I haven't used it extensively, not as much as the wired keyboard. Okay. Let's take a look at both of these side by side so you can see the size comparison. Here they are side by side. This is the wired keyboard by Amazon Basics. This is the wireless keyboard by Amazon Basics. So let's just type with this. Hello. Very nice keys on this. I think the keys on this one are nicer than the keys on the wired one. It's just silent. It just feels better. Whereas here it's... Honestly, I think the wireless keyboard is a better keyboard. Like it feels better. It feels like... I don't know, it just feels better, whereas this one, um, the keys don't feel, it just feels a little bit different. Like the keys are more separated. So let me just zoom in, see how the keys are separated here? And then see how the keys are more close together here? So it just has a really nice feel, the wireless keyboard. And if, and if you're wondering why don't I use the wireless keyboard, well that's a really good question. Maybe I should start using it, but honestly it's the fact that it uses batteries. So you do have to have batteries for the wireless keyboard which I'm not a fan of. It's just AAA batteries, as you can see there. I have some Amazon Basics batteries in there, but honestly, I already use a wireless mouse, so I just don't want something else wireless that uses batteries. Maybe someday if I buy more batteries, I'll consider using this one a little bit more because this one definitely does feel better than this one. Let's look at the backspace keys, shift and enter here. So, because sometimes you get keyboards that have weird stuff. This is pretty good, right? All looks, all looks standard. Uh, everything looks nice and big. The control keys look big. Um, it all looks good. Nothing looks funky on either of these keyboards. I feel like it's a very standard layout and it just, it, it definitely feels better than the one I use. It's kind of funny because here we have a wireless keyboard that I don't really use that much and I'm saying it's better than the one I use. And again, the reason is this requires batteries and it's been holding me back. As far as the mouse, I say the mouse is okay. Um, Amazon Basics does make a better mouse. I prefer the Amazon Basics ergonomic mouse. That's the one I use, which is not um, included with this keyboard. This one just comes with a regular Amazon Basics mouse, which is pretty good, uh, and it's wireless. So, yeah, it's a nice combo. If you're if you're looking for a wireless combo, uh, definitely go with the wireless by Amazon Basics. If you prefer wired, go with this. Um, what really holds me back from wireless is the battery usage. That's really what prevents me from making this my main keyboard. Both great keyboards, both by Amazon Basics. Again, the wired keyboard is the one I use on a regular basis, and the wireless keyboard I don't use as much. I think that the wireless keyboard is a better keyboard in terms of like the keys, it feels better, but it does require batteries. Also, it does come with an Amazon Basics mouse, which is really nice. So if you're looking for wireless, definitely go with the wireless. Just keep in mind, you will need batteries for the mouse and for the keyboard. Right, we're comparing keyboards here because this one doesn't come with a mouse. So keyboard versus keyboard, um, no battery, and then battery on the wireless. I prefer the wired, but if you want wireless, go with the wireless. I do think it feels better. The keys feel better. I think it's a better keyboard. They're both great though, and I hope it's been helpful. Good luck.